IKEA is one of the biggest furniture stores in the world, making everyday life easier for 936 million visitors annually worldwide. However, 90% of visitors travel to IKEA by car. Needless to say, that isn't too good for the environment. Meanwhile, IKEA has a goal to be 100% renewable by 2020. Is there a way for IKEA to encourage visitors to travel more sustainably while simultaneously attracting new customers? IKEA has a huge problem with food waste. Over 300 kilograms of food per warehouse a day is thrown away. The waste is shipped for disposal and converted into biogas. However, IKEA doesn't use the biogas for own purposes. We want to change that. Introducing Kurt Bullen. Kurt Bullen, Swedish for meatball, is a free of charge shuttle cab powered by IKEA's own food waste. The traditional Swedish meatball served at every IKEA can now be used as fuel. The food waste is converted into biogas. The biogas gets converted into biofuel. The biofuel is used to drive Kurt Bullen, thereby helping customers reach IKEA. Compared to ordinary cars, Kurt Bullen's carbon footprint is tiny. 10 petrol fueled cars carrying two people each, driving 20 kilometers, emits 45 kilograms of carbon dioxide. The 20 seated Kurt Bullen, covering the same distance, only emits 2.4 kilograms. That's a reduction in carbon emissions of almost 95%. In line with IKEA's vision to create a better everyday life for the many people, Kurt Bullen helps the customer to travel eco-friendly while saving money. 30% of IKEA's customers come to the warehouse only to eat. That and the increasing use of home delivery reduces the need of transport space that cars offer. Furthermore, through positioning the shuttle cab in poorly connected parts of cities, the service will facilitate travel to and from IKEA for the everyday consumer. More visitors mean more food and furniture sold. IKEA's goal is to be 100% renewable by 2020. Kurt Bullen is a part of the change.